Hey, what's up, YouTube? I'm back at it again with another book review. And this book review was on the book Teenage Love Affair by Mimi Simone. And I would give this book definitely four stars. It was basically a young adult book, so it didn't, really, it didn't have sex in it. It mentioned sex, but it didn't really have sex in it. But it was about this girl named Zaza. And when she was younger, it started talking about how she had an older brother and a little sister. And her mother was, always used to get abused by her father. And her older brother, he was just never home because of that. He didn't want to deal with it. And every week and every Friday, her father would come home with Chinese food and beer. They would have Chinese food. Then he would start drinking. His mother was, Her mother would say something to piss her father off and then when they were in the room he would start beating on her and it would just be the same thing all the time and that made her not like Johnny Sue. So basically talked about that when she was growing up and how her mother would press charges every time he hit her and then he she would not go through with it. And then there was this boy she went to school with named Malachi and they had a little puppy love together and she would go up to his room with her little sister when her parents were um fighting and her best friend Courtney was a gay guy and and her other best friend which was a girl and Malachi he, he had moved away for some because his parents was trying to find a job somewhere else, and she didn't see him for five years, and then he decided to move back when she was in high school, and they went to the same high school, and she started chilling with him again. She found out she still had feelings for him, he still had feelings for her, but the problem was she had a boyfriend named Amin, and he was the type, he was nice at times, but then he started to beat on her, and she was a type of, you know, it was a big deal, you know, he did it sometimes, whatever. And she was always in denial, saying she wasn't like her mother and stuff like that. And then the beatings got worse. They eventually broke up. She did start dating Malachi. He was a sweetheart. He always treated her right. But Mead was a type who, like, always constantly call her and make her feel guilty about all this stuff and she will always give in and that affected her relationship with Malachi so you just see this whole kind of like a love triangle or a love a teenage love affair so and it was really it was really good it was basically like a life lesson about domestic violence and girls dealing with that and, you know, how you need to love yourself and be strong. And just if you are in a, a violent relationship, you need to get out of it and get some help. So I think this was really a good coming-of-the-age coming book. Anybody can read it, but it's very good for teenagers growing up in relationships and stuff like that. So I would say definitely check this book out. It was definitely a good book.